Now, here's Chief Meteorologist Tony Petrarca with your live Pinpoint Doppler 12 Futurecast. Well, not expecting a, a big storm, but we think enough snow to make some slippery travel, some small accumulations. We're getting some uh, light mixed precipitation right now. It's cool right now, uh, but not terribly cold. But I do expect the temperatures to be uh, dropping off this evening and during the overnight because some light mixed precipitation in uh, places like Newport right now. I see some the uh, camera lenses has some raindrops on it now. 35 in Newport. Temperatures are actually above freezing in most locations with the exception of Smithfield, but these numbers uh, will be coming down. So threat tracker tonight, through at least early tomorrow morning uh, and elevated to yellow light snow this evening. The most out towards southeast mass in the Cape. Slippery travel later on this evening and during the overnight once the temperatures go below freezing. I do anticipate at least some leftover snow early tomorrow morning and still slippery early at least on any untreated surfaces than drier weather by the afternoon hours. So second half of Tuesday uh, looking better. Satellite and radar composite showing uh, the moisture offshore. Developing weak storm off the mid-Atlantic and the Carolina coastline will pass south and east, but close enough to graze this with some of that precipitation and some snow. And even though it's not real cold right now, I do expect cold air to be draining in this evening and during the overnight. So there should be a mainly uh, snow situation, light snow, despite some mixed uh, rain uh, going on right now. Future cast shots off at 7 o'clock this evening. The blue represents the snow. And notice the coverage becomes more widespread later on this evening. This is late at night, 1 o'clock in the morning, 29 degrees. Take it to around 5, 6 o'clock in the morning, mid-20s with light to moderate snow and then the precipitation uh, starting to wind down uh, later on the evening uh, later on in the morning and towards the afternoon hours this is one o'clock in the afternoon it's drying out even some partial clearing by late day and into the early evening the evening commute uh, looks okay but certainly slippery uh, early uh, tomorrow morning again final snowfall accumulations overnight towards daybreak uh, Providence uh, south and east, 1 to 2. That includes Warwick, Cranston, Fall River, Newport, out towards uh, westerly along Route 1. Little Compton, Middletown, Fall River, Taunton, and then well to the north and west, the northwest part of the state, up to an inch. You get out towards roughly New Bedford, eastward towards the Cape on the order of three to five. So the most snow out there. But even here, a couple of inches of snow, it's all it takes to cause, well, to cause that. So be careful as the uh, temperatures drop this evening and during the overnight. Some leftover light snow tomorrow morning, ending by mid morning. Very cold at 24. And then during the afternoon, drier weather, looking at temperatures low 30s under partly to mostly cloudy skies. Seven day future cast shows chilly dry weather on Wednesday. Thursday day looks dry. Some rain and snow showers Thursday night. Early morning snow showers Friday drying out in the afternoon. Cold on Saturday. Watching Sunday with some interest. Still have some snow in the forecast. We'll keep you updated. That's still six uh, six days down the road with a temperature in uh, the upper 30s. So again, small accumulations later on this evening overnight towards uh, early tomorrow morning. Uh, statewide, at least for Rhode Island, anywhere from uh, a cold to a couple of inches, get out towards New Bedford, the Cape Cod Canal between roughly three and uh, five inches of snow. So uh, certainly take it slow as things become a little slippery once the temperature falls below freezing tonight. Right. Thank you, Tony. Still